and Veronica Kurufa, the Women's Empowerment Coordinator. Welcome, come on in. People seeking asylum have fled trouble and persecution in their home countries and are seeking to make a new life. This is their human right. They can come here and become members of ASRC. The ASRC started 17 years ago and all you can see has been built through community support, providing hope and support to more than 12,000 refugees. The door opens at 10 a.m. every morning People come through and are welcomed by our reception. The reception manages phone calls, queries, and people coming in and out of ASRC. This is our food bank. Our food bank provides free groceries to our members. We need the food bank because our members don't have guaranteed access to work and income. We provide food for more than 600 people a week. More than half don't have income, and a third are children. We have community meals here every day, from Monday to Friday. Here, the volunteers prepare food first for our members, then for the staff and volunteers. We serve a hot meal to around 240 people a day. To most members, this is their main meal, and to some, the only meal. Many of our members also volunteer at the kitchen, and it's a good way to show their culture. We all come together for community meals at lunchtime, between half past 12 to half past one. We also have health, legal, casework, and mental health support for our members. We are here in ASRC Innovation Hub. In here, we work in an empowerment model. Empowerment means we work with people seeking asylum to make their own choices and to determine their own path. Here, we have empowerment, education, employment, entrepreneurs program and social enterprise all working together in empowering people seeking asylum. The Women's Empowerment Program is part of the hub, empowering our women members. ASRC is the home of hope for people seeking asylum. Thank you for visiting ASRC. Hope you will come again. Bye!